afternoon, Elizabeth Ide. Today I'm going to read to you Five Little Penguins Slipping on the Ice by Steve Metzger. This is a book all about counting and numbers up to five. So on the back it says, Five Little Penguins Slipping on the Ice. One fell down. Ouch! That's not nice. Four little penguins are left to play. Then mother called the doctor. What did he say? So what do you predict the doctor will say? Knowing a doctor, if you're playing on the ice and you slip, what do you think they might say to you? Are they gonna tell you to continue to play on the ice or are they gonna tell you something else? So we're gonna to read to find out. Five little penguins slipping on the ice. One fell down, ouch, that's not nice. The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, no more penguins slipping on the ice. Do you think those five penguins are going to continue playing on the ice or are they gonna to listen to the doctor and their mom? Make a prediction. Uh-oh, did they listen? No. Four little penguins sliding near a tree. <gasps> what do you think will happen? They're sliding near a tree. What will happen? One fell into the icy sea. <gasps> what would happen if you fell into the icy sea? What do you think? Would somebody be there to rescue if it was just you and either your friends or your siblings without your parents? So the mother called the doctor and the doctor said, what do you think? It's going to repeat itself. No more penguins sliding near a tree. Do you think they're going to continue going on the ice or sliding near a tree? Make a prediction. See what you think. Three little penguins skating all around. Have you ever gone skating before? Ice skating? I know down in Chicago at Millennium Park, they do ice skating every year and there's always a really big line. So if you've never done that, maybe this next winter time, you could try it out. But I hope what happens to this next penguin doesn't happen to you. One flew up and then fell down. The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, no more penguins skating all around. So how many is left if one fell down? So we've gone from five to four to three to make a prediction. Two little penguins playing on a hill. What do you think their favorite thing is to do up on that hill? One slipped off and banged her bill. Now, if you know about penguins and you've learned about them, if you've been in first grade already, I know our first grade teachers are really good about teaching us about penguins during some of our math units. Think about what is the bill? And I'm gonna show you up close. What is that little penguin holding on to? Her bill, that's kind of like what would be similar to her nose and her mouth. The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, no more penguins playing on a hill. Think about what this book might remind you of. And if it doesn't remind you of something, it might remind your parents who are around Mrs. Fletcher's age, a story called Five Little Monkeys Jumping on the Bed. And if you've never read that story, after you read this one, I want you to read that because it's pretty similar and it's very cute. One little penguin jumping very high. <gasps> did he touch the sky or did he fall down? Make a prediction. Broke the ice and began to cry. The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, no more penguins jumping very high. So now that mother has had gone from five penguins to four, to three, to two, to one, what comes after that? There's no penguins anymore to be playing. I wonder what they're going to be doing. Make a prediction. What do you think they're gonna be doing? Are they gonna be playing? Let's find out. Now there's no little penguins having any fun. No little penguins, not even one. 
The other animals are looking all around for them. Where do you think they are? If one of them slipped on ice, and when they were playing with skates and down hills, and they were going very high and they fell um, kind of into the sea and they hurt their bill, what do you think is gonna be happening to them? Where are they going to be at while they're recovering, while they're trying to get better? The mother called the doctor and the doctor said, what do you think is gonna be happening? None of them are playing. What is the doctor gonna say? Let those penguins have some fun. They must have healed up and got better. So after you get injured or you're having fun and some accident happens, what's something you like to do to have fun after? Because the penguins all did what? They all went skating again on the ice and even mama penguin came too. So think of a fun little activity that you do by yourself maybe, with your friends, with your family members, with your parents. Think about that and share one thing and share one of the lessons you've learned of maybe something you shouldn't do, especially when the doctor says you shouldn't. Hope you enjoyed.